this was the dream that I wanted when my daughter was born. Mm -hmm. We used to buy her men's clothes, mm -hmm. boys' clothes, mm -hmm. you know, for it to be modest. The first one mm -hmm. that I started is just to sleep on for, e for easy, mm -hmm. you know, wear. Mm -hmm. and, then we, and then we went ahead and did something for like grown-ups so kids mm -hmm. can feel like you know they they are like grown-ups they were like grown-ups mm -hmm. and then we created this atika hijab which is has openings for the mask or the stethoscope so anybody in the medical field would need it yeah it's easy wear because they don't have to juggle and pull the scarf mm -hmm. here and there i started actually when my daughter was born and then when she turned nine and we noticed that you know we were having hard time finding scarves you know for her age I'm a seamstress mm -hmm. by nature, so that's something that I started doing. And then I noticed that everybody in the community started asking, you know, where did you get this? How did you do this? So I said, you know, why not start and then, you know, help everybody else? And that's what I've been doing. I created just two years ago. Uh, she worked as a nurse assistant. And when COVID hit, she was having a hard time using the mask and all that other charade. So I created a, a scarf for her, which is called the Atika hijab. And this is something very easily, you know, worn. Oh, so smart. Yeah. So you just need people to know you're here? Yes. Yes, you just I need, need people, people to know, to know that here. we are here. Yeah. yeah. My business was impacted by COVID very much because I started right before COVID and then COVID hit. and. You know, there was no sales, nobody walking in, nobody, you know. So it, I just had to, you know, I was open, but there was no sales. Mm -hmm. So it was very hard, but I, I wasn't going to give up. This is something I really wanted to do it, and I wasn't going to give up. So if I had to babysit someone or do that to survive, I did it. The $10,000 is going to help me grow and advertise, let people know that I am here. You know, uh, there, here's are the product for the girls who are looking to wear hijab. Hijab is something, it's a necessity for us Muslim, you know. So this, they know that, oh, there is somebody, there is someone here, you know, where we can buy this. Anything that you produce has to be in quantity. So I need the money to buy the material. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've been in the business, like in the, we opened the store three years ago, right before COVID hit. And you know, we haven't taken paying at, pay at home, which is fine for me because I know that what I'm doing is helping other kids. But you cannot survive. <laughs> you cannot survive with that. I really needed the money to support the business, to grow, uh, to bring my dreams come true. Mm -hmm. This is something that our new generation, the kids, especially for them. To Comcast, I would like to say that you are an angel who just dropped down to help me that I, you know i have no words i have no words for that this is a, a blessing a blessing in disguise absolutely a blessing